Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of What Do You Need to Know to Live in Costa Rica. Today, we are exploring the very popular Isca Zoo. I'm Patrick Jager here as always with my very good friend and business partner, Aaron Bailey. Hey, Aaron. Pura Vida, Patrick. Pura Vida. And today, we are starting a series where we are going to break down all the different big expat communities in the country, starting with one of the most popular, Escazú. You live Escazú adjacent. Adjacent. I can see it out my window, my 16th floor window. I live in San Jose, but I'm facing Escazú. I spend a lot of time there. I shop there. I co-work there. Uh, I go out to eat there. So let's talk all things Escazoo. Uh, it's, uh, the, you know, kind of the upscale suburb immediately outside of San Jose to the west, uh, along the 27. It's sometimes referred to as the Beverly Hills of Costa Rica, which it's really hard to compare. Beverly yeah, because I don't Hills think Beverly Escazoo. Hills has a Hooters, but I yeah, digress. Exactly. <laughs> it might. It probably does. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but there are a number of expats there. There are a number of embassies in uh, both my neighborhood in Roma Sur, but also in Escazú. So it's got a lot of luxury amenities like a country yeah. club, the the really nice, the the probably the best hospital in Costa Rica, Sima, is in Escazú. It's got the mall, the upscale mall, all the um, malls. All, All the malls, stores. yes, exactly. So it's got a really great location. You can get, you know, you can live in a in a lovely condo there, uh, or you can live in a really nice house, a single Massive family house. house. Yeah, up in the hills. Um, so you know, and it's somewhat affordable, but we'll get into this. But it can also be ridiculously expensive. Yeah. So if you're trying to envision Costa Rica from a location perspective, as Aaron said, we are in the Central Valley, which is the where the hub of all, the, the largest population lives in the Central Valley. Escazú is just to the west. It's off of the, the newly built uh, toll highway, the 27, which gets you down to the Pacific beaches. Uh, my house in, in Atenas is off the 27 as well. Um, it is considered um, it's considered, you know, very typical valley location. Um, it's very densely packed. Roads are a little askew because they weren't, you know, they were small roads that cars have just gotten bigger and much more has been built up. But as you said, there's a lot of natural beauty. Um, and one of the big reasons that people live there is the climates. Tell us about the climate there. Uh, you know, it, like San Jose, it's a it's a tropical monsoon. There is the the rainy season, the wet season from May to November, roughly. Um, humid, overcast, um, sunny mornings and early afternoons starts raining around two o'clock. Um, dry season, December to April ish. Um, you know, you're you're going te temperatures anywhere from low 20s to high 20s mostly it can get into the the low 30s as well um that's, it's really lovely is, weather that is celsius people just... and that's celsius sorry i'm i'm a, i'm attempting to get into celsius 70s and 80s um really kind of eternal spring um Ooh, like bordering on 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 summer uh, you know depending on on the temperature but yeah it's really lovely weather yeah, I would say the thing to know about Escazú too is the vibe is very urban. It's a shopping hub, as we mentioned. It's very commercial. Lots of great design uh, shops all throughout Escazú. Lots of you know, the, lots of very Americanized. You can get everything from Carolyn Herrera to an iPhone to a Starbucks to uh, Crate and Barrel and know. Krispy Kreme. And Krispy Kreme and Kirkland products at our version of Costco called Price Smart. That's um, right, yes. So, and then you can go to the hospital because you ate too many Krispy Kremes <laughs> at Price Smart. But, you know. Um, yeah. Great movie theaters. Yeah. Um, and, and from a distance perspective, it's about 30 minutes to the international airport in San Jose, um, depending on traffic. Um, I will say that uh, it doesn't take much on these freeways to see a backup. Uh, it took me last week, I had to go 
I had to go through Escazú and then back down to a place called Heredia. And uh, it took me over two hours just because of backups on the freeway. But again, that's no different than Chicago or Boston or L.A. or New York. Absolutely. Yep. But it's still it's a great location. And, and most of the time, it's really great. Easy shot to the airport. Yeah. And, um, right, so give everybody kind of the ultimate rankings they need to know for this community. Yeah. So I think... Cost of living is is going to be one of the highest in Costa Rica. It's going to be expensive. Um, like I said, you can find not so expensive, but for the most part, it is it is going to be more expensive. The nightlife, there's tons of nightlife uh, in Escazú. Lots of great uh, restaurants uh, and bars. Love going out in Escazú. It is LGBTQ friendly without a doubt. Uh, no problems there. The walking score, for the most part, depending on where you're at, you, you can walk around. Uh, there are a lot of busy streets that you wouldn't want to walk in, but then there are a lot of neighborhoods that, that you could easily walk through and, and not have to deal with uh, cars. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, air quality. I think, you know, it's, it's, it's next to downtown San Jose, so the air quality is not going to be as great as some pristine mountain somewhere, Monteverde. But, um, you know, it, it, air quality has never bothered me. What's, no, it's great. It's still Coast, great. Yeah, yeah. There's never a smog yeah. layer. You're not ever going to no. not see. No. And that's just from clouds. But you're never going to have that kind yeah. of problem. No, all right. not at all. So that's Escazú in a nutshell. There's obviously a lot of nuancey stuff about Escazú. But the big headlines, if we're going to leave you with headlines, it is very urban, shopping hub, uh, uh, nightlife hub, um, uh, wealthier area, a lot of fun to go to. We'd happily meet you out for coffee somewhere Absolutely. in Escazú. Uh, and Christmas. if you want more information on Escazú or any town in Costa Rica or anything else we talk about, how do they connect with us, Aaron? Hola at yourpuravita.com. Uh, grab all of our links and uh, all of our resources on our website at yourpiravieta.com slash links. Uh, if you like this video, would love a thumbs up from you. And to see future videos, hit the subscribe and the little bell button to be alerted. That really helps uh, other people see these, these videos as well. Would appreciate that. And I think that's all we've got for Escazú Costa Rica. Till next time in another city, Puerto Vida. Puerto Vida. Puerto Vida.